Hello, I am Anne from Geek Life Luxembourg, and I'm here with Gerard Kraus. Hello, Gerard. Hello. How are you today? I'm good, thank you. Tell me, what is LuxCon exactly? Uh, LuxCon is Luxembourg's science fiction, fantasy, and horror convention. We call it the Festival of the Imagination. Since when is LuxCon? Um, we started organizing LuxCon in 2013. The first edition was in 2014. We're now doing our third LuxCon. And why did you want to do a convention here in Luxembourg? Because nobody else was doing one and uh, we saw loads of people around that would probably enjoy conventions and everybody came out to the conventions ever since. So what do you offer to people at LuxCon? Uh, everything a normal convention has. We have vendors, we've got editors, we've got writers, workshops, panels, uh, discussion groups, uh, contests, and so on and so forth. So uh, whatever you want to, or however you want to explore uh, fantasy, sci-fi, and horror, you can do that at LuxCon. Did you have a lot of people this year? Uh, yes, we had uh, 1,800 people on Saturday, and I imagine that the Sunday would be the same thing again. So about 4,000 people this time around. And who, which artist and writer were here this year, the most famous one? Uh, we had Ian MacDonald here, who's a famous British uh, author. Um, then we had Tommy Kropfweiss, who's a German uh, director, writer, actor, uh, and, and all the other things, comedian as well. <laughs> Uh, comedian, we had uh, David Grasshoff, who's also a guy who does comedy. We had Markus Heitz, who people know for uh, Die Zwerge, the, Ger the German fantasy epic. Um, we had Franck Roger here, who's a Belgian surreal sci-fi writer. Uh, Nina Horvat was an um, uh, Austrian fan who came to visit us. And then many local, regional uh, people, uh, writers and artists who, who came to uh, show off their work at LuxCon. Did everything went well at LuxCon, almost? Uh, yes. Uh, so far I've not heard of anything going majorly wrong. We had some uh, snafus in the program with people not being able to attend or with people having to leave early or being sick, that sort of stuff. But uh, I think we were able to compensate for most of that. So um, there was no major problems. So you're happy with this year's con? Yes, absolutely. Uh, we had a great turnout. The weather was nice for most of the time. Um, everybody seemed to be having fun. There was no major incident. So, yeah, good convention this year. Thank you very much, Sarah. Thank you. <laughs>